a ram or overgrowth of the rabbits in the biting. And, uh, well, there's no biting. Why, why are we biting stuff? I don't know. <laughs> what, what is, what's with this stuff? Then the architecture and the... Never mind. Time to get a move on. Let's move it on. Moving on. Moving on. Moving on. Okay. That's not what he meant, apparently. Um. That would, were we trying this level last time, or did we try this level at all? I don't think we tried this level at all. I don't remember. It's been a couple days. Oh god, there's somebody right there. And by somebody, I mean a zombie, apparently, because that's apparently what we're dealing with. Apparently. Watch, it'll come along in the storyline and be like, nope, not zombies. They're actually demons, or, you know, <laughs> something weird. Oh god, there's a zombie demon. Eh. I should probably sneak up on that one and kill it quickly. I'm gonna kill you. Ha! <laughs> yeah, I'm strangling your midsection. Yeah! Yeah, take that diaphragm. Ha ha! Yeah! Alright. Now, where is the A and the B? Right clicks, right click, right click. Flap, 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 flap. All right, all right, calm down, calm down, calm down. Where's my bee? Hmm. I don't see anybody. Why am I sneaking? Not that it would help much if they're looking at me. Um. Uh, I mean, obviously. Oh, there's somebody over there looking. Read what? Really? There's something to read here, huh? Uh, if you say so. An ancient note. I wonder how old it is. I'll bet it's real old, because it's gone. I spotted the most peculiar event today. Invisible notes that people could apparently read. A citizen appears to be completely normal and sane yesterday, and was apparently... Well, following something invisible to our eyes. Okay, this is a little creepy. Because <laughs> that's the note. The note is invisible. I would ran to recite our advisor's tellings to him. To believe the whispers as far as they had arrived, you were astray. But I was foolish. Foolish mortal. I feared for my own life as a consequence, as one of us, one of us has been swallowed whole by the spirits dwelling in the trees. Okay. So it's a snake. It's a snake spirit in the trees. Must be but an advisor. Can't get it out of my mind. Cause I'm crazy. Somebody's coming. Okay. <laughs> Calm down. Jump kicks. Ugh. I'm good. Oh, oh, I can't I can't stop moving. Oh. Ha ha. Super sneaky. Huh? Nope. Whoa, did you see that? I moonwalked on that thing. Where did that guy go? I think... I think people are chasing me. Yeah. And by people... Ow. I mean zombies. Zombie people demons. Ha ha. Ho ho. Ha ha, surprise! All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Would you hear something? Were oh, you back down this way? Wait, you're up here. Wait, where? What? They're in the stairs. Do you hear that? Interesting. Okay. They're bugged out in the stairs. You are not, though. Yeah. Ooh, rabbit fights. It's all about the jumping. <laughs> it's apparently about the stick to the side of the head as well. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. 
All right. Serious time. Oh. I thought you were facing the other way. Now you are. Haha. -ha. I'm going to hold your armpits so you can't breathe. Stop breathing. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I mean, I think they stopped breathing as soon as I started holding their windpipe shut, but, you know, continue to not breathe. You need to hold them long enough for them to be convinced that not breathing is something they want to do. And then when you let go, they won't breathe. You know, you just gotta hold them a long time. It takes them a while to con con convince them. You know, it takes a while. What is that, booze? Booze. Hmm. Hmm. We we'll get some booze. Oh yeah, and there's a flask there and everything. Yeah, I can just I can just booze it up. Can I get up here? I mean I can, but there's no point. Obviously, booze. <laughs> oh god, I shouldn't have drank so much. Where? I see somebody right over there. Don't don't you see me? No 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 no. Yeah, that's a nice stick you got there. Huh. Danger music. Here, come over here. And, uh... And, and take a nap behind this crate so that these people who know where I am don't find out that I'm here. Uh. Hello. Om. Hoppa. Zen. Hua. <laughs> Zen body flops. Man, I can't... I can't face thee. With your stick? I, I mean, I probably could have done that better. <laughs> but... Basically, I'm gonna have to sneak through this. For the most part. Oh, also, by the way... Um, I got a new microphone. Uh, I just... I just realized that because the cord is being a little bit crazy, so... Uh, but yeah, I remember now I have a new microphone because I got a new headset. So if I sound different, that's why. Oh, God. Nar. My foot stinks. Okay. Right in the belly. Ow, the throws, dude. Oh, man. Alright, so you turn around, you do that, so I'll just land here and choke out your armpits. Yes. Armpits. Also, I just noticed the shirt, their shirt is tucked into their pants. I mean, not, not like into their pants, but like it's tied to their pants. You see that? They don't need a belt because their, their shirt is holding up their pants. That's kind of genius. Huh, anyway. Enough about pants. Do, do, do my pants do that? No, I got like suspenders. I think. I think. I think. Wait, no. The, no, that's just an armor piece on the outside. I don't know what I got. My pants go up to my belly button. I guess you don't need a belt when they go up that far. Hmm. Maybe that's why some people have pants that go up that far. You know, mainly older people. You don't really see a lot of the hip kids with their pants up that far. I don't know. Anyway, this is enough about pants. Solomon Grundy won't pants too. Oh, no, 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 don't see me. Alright, good. Alright, so last time I went to choke him out, two people saw me. People zombie demons. Demons. The demons. I just remembered, uh, uh, you know, I just got reminded of Doom. The new Doom. The demons. It's the human sacrifices. This, this, it's a... Ah. This is just a section that I've heard multiple times because I tried to... Uh, I knew I was going to die there, so I wasn't... Oh, Jesus! Oh! Okay! I've kind of figured out where I can go without being seen. This is this is why I like doing things the first try. 
because then it's you know more legitimate I mean if you know exactly what to do it's a lot easier who sees me everybody no way man Jeez. Man, cord. Yeah, now I gotcha. Haha. <laughs> go. Roll out as we do. Yeah, that's it. Roll out. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, you didn't, you didn't see nothing. You didn't see me. You didn't see me. Uh, uh. Alright, now we stealth around. Stealth around. Stealth around. Can we go around this way? Is there anywhere to go over here? What if we just go over here? Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Oh. Is there somebody up there? No, that's just a pole. Eh. Okay, alright. Super sneaky bunny. I should have done this a long time ago. <laughs> Stealth mode. Dude. Alright. And I think we're at the point in the game where we're past going A or B. Because we're just getting one portal every time. Dots. And then dots. And then why are they here? Why are who here? These portals or those rabbits? I don't know. Alright. We are eager to push this cataclysm into the past. Oh wait, no. The, the, the Grand Elder Spirit Gods are eager. Yeah, yeah and they went to work. They created a new world around bones. Around the bones. They were like, hey, look at these bones. Wouldn't this be a great place for people to live? Let's let's make a world, and then let's make a people, and let's make them live in these bones. That'll be hilarious. Okay, anyway. Another ancient fortress. And a question mark. What do you know? Well, that guy's got a swade. It's a big old swade. And I'm gonna leave him for Oh, God, I can speak. No, well, I can't because I'm a zombie with a sword. Fine. Yeah, that's. Oh, where are they taking him? He must know how to get out of here. He, oh, he must. Really? Because he's prisoner. Uh huh. He's, he's a prisoner and he must know how to get out. I don't think that's how that works, dude. You know? <laughs> it's not like. Alright, now that you're our captive, we're gonna tell you exactly how to get out of here. So that you know. Uh, uh, why would you... But why? He didn't see me. I better take care of him. Is anybody looking? Nobody looking? Oh, that's good. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Alright, that works. Uh, that... That might be interesting over there, but I gotta find out if there's bad guys. Where are the bad guys? Yeah, uh, jumped. Hello, my name is Inigo Montoya, and I'm gonna choke your chest out. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right. Now, what, what, what's over here? You look like you're not having a good day. Jesus. Recent note. Must be a spy. Uh, well, not anymore. Now he's a corpse. Foxglove here. The creatures biologically have it. Oh, there are, are they? The movements, mannerisms, and nothing like we've seen. They're like zombies. At the time of writing, there's no verbal or visible communication between the creatures. And yet, every action seems to be coordinated. More than the age. Average centipede, the artist, soldier. So they are coordinated. Zombies. At the time of writing, there's only been one recorded instance of these creatures uh, being within the proximity of a reaper. 
What's that? What's that? The Reaper, unlike their unlike their usual behavior amongst the Sindrith, so they are completely ignoring the creatures. Oh. Okay. Entry seems to be cut short. Really? Really? It's just cut short? There's no, like, bwee, like trailing off in handwriting? Just like, bwee, a, 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 dot, dot, dot. And then, like, a splat of blood. None of that? No? That'd be too obvious or something? Or, or like, why would he write that many A's as he's being stabbed? I don't know. Turn around, you over there. I want to kill you. I'm going to kill it instead. Hey. What's up? No, no. He's better at killing stuff. Man, I tripped him up really bad. And he didn't even care. He's like, you know what? I can recover from this. <laughs> Jesus. Hello. Give me your stick. You know, I'm gonna come over here so you can't be seen. And then, yeah, give me the stick. Alright. Now you. Ha! Ha! Just wappa. And then choke you out. Yeah! Even though it looks like I've impaled you with the stick. <laughs> you know? Kinda looks like that, but it, it, it isn't. Oh no, I'm a prisoner! Oh no! Ah, a guard! Do you have any notes? Why are my frames so bad in here? Weird. Do, 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 do. Anyway. Well. This may not have been as good of an idea as I thought. Oh, I can just climb over that? That doesn't hurt. Oh, not yet, anyway. Now it does. Oh, God. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Ooh, cornhole. Oh, dude. That looks bad. That's bad. You don't want to do that. <laughs> this guy has iron bunghole training. You don't you don't want to try that. You want to work your way up to that. Surprise. I'm not here. 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 Yeah, I'm not. I got you. Give me that sword. Give me, give me the sword. Give me the sword. How do I? Yeah, hey, I'm gonna play with your body again. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Looks like something else. Okay. I can't get the sword. I can't. I don't know how to put down the thing. Don't know how to do it, guys. Yeah. All right. I don't care. A stick is power. Many, many nations have fallen before the mighty quarterstaff. Yeah. What do you got? You got a sword in your chest? Or your back? Whatever. Doesn't matter. It's in you. And it's a sword, and I can't have it because I already got this. There's probably a button for it, and somebody will tell me in the comments. And it's not going to help me now, but it will help me later. And it might help whoever's watching. If, if they want to play this game. Hey, hey you. Hey you, are you okay? Or something? Yeah. It's like, no, I'm a prisoner. I'm here to help. I need to get out of here. Just, you just jump real hard and then hold right click to grab the edge. That's how you get out. Uh, didn't expect anybody to actually save me. I think it's pretty super pretty mercy. Probably not. No, probably not. Come on, let's get out of here. It's all, it's all us. We gotta go. The right, oh, I clicked, I clicked. But he said the lantern try and take me there. Alright. What does go? What if I jumped into your cage? Ha ha. Look, you don't even have spikes on this side. Come on, you can't even do the thing. You know what I mean? Jeez. <laughs> the thing. Hold on. I've got to uh gotta get a quick screenshot of, of that. Just just for a thumbnail purpose. Get, get a right out. Oh man. Eh, eh, eh. Bungle. Does that. Does that work? I can't. I don't think I'm actually gonna get a big screenshot out of it. 
Anyways, moving on. How's your wounds? I've just been bruised. They wouldn't kill me like the others. Why? But it hurts much. It does. Do you know how to use these shrines? Dude, you know how to use these shrines. You walk up to it and you mutter something nonsensical. And then, and then you get it. He says, yeah, I figured it out. What's what you were waiting for, me? How would they know? Because they're the Borg. Because the Borg are like zombies, but they're hive mind zombies. And then you, you follow me through here. You take me back to camp. Yeah. Ghost. Thinking. He says, thinking. He's, th he's thinking this in his head. And he says, oh, I he doesn't know who I am. Nobody does. I don't I don't know who you are, and I am you. In that case, how about the rest of his crew didn't know either? Oh, wait, he's a Cinderbreed Empire soldier, right? That's what it is. He's a bad guy. I should bop him over the head. <laughs> Alright, now he's talking out loud, and he says, All right, let's go through. Let's do this. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. And right now, my enemy is being lost. And this guy knows how to find his way. So he's the enemy of being lost, so he's my friend. Get it? It's smart. Alright, the very first landmark in the world was born. Red Crete Fountain. Or Crete. Or Crete? Or Crepe? Or Crete? That thing. A red fountain under a dense and purple, dark purple sky. And with it, three spirit lanterns to house the oldest and grand elder spirit gods. The G. The G-E-S-G. The The guess g The Yeah. Where is he? Is he in the campfire? I don't think so. Maybe if I keep looking at it. I checked a hundred times all the way around the weird shrine thing. You're not gonna find it. He's not at the shrine. He's on the other side of the shrine. He's gonna come through the shrine. And so you just sit there and wait. What about the footprints? What about footprints? What footprints? I checked everything. Didn't see any trace. Looking for me? Here I am. Where did you go? We were worried sick. And then we were worried healthy again. And then we got worried sick again. We've, we've been back and forth. You've been gone so long, we went back and forth here. We got over it, and then we got... Okay, never mind. Are you wounded? You don't look too well. Well, I'm okay. And this guy's cool, too. And he's like, here I am. And I'm like, ha-ha! Oh, wait, wait, that's the guy in the armor, isn't it? I thought he looked familiar. Yeah, that's the guy in the armor, hence the armor. But yeah, he says, thanks for taking to Tashan. Tashon. Must have the stories to tell, and I'd sit down, but I gotta get moving. Not without a reward. Take a few petals, pe petal, flower petals, flowers, coins, coins, Fla coin flowers, swords, swords. But I'm in a mystical place. I have no place to buy a sword. Thanks. Gonna get directions to the emperor. You'll need to talk to Brand. Brand. That almost sounds like a human name. Everybody else in this game has always said, or well, I don't know. Never mind, never mind. Don't pay attention to that. Buy our tents. He has the map. Okay. Thank you again for taking me to Sean. See, well that's kind of a that's kind of a humanish name too. I guess I guess in the original story they were like wind and shadow and boogers, you know, it's like feel free to join in at any time. Join in to what? Gambling? How about that story? What, you got some gambling going on over here? I'm on fire, you see that? Yeah. <laughs> I, he says, feel free to join in. All right, I'm in. Hey, buddy. All right, all right. I'm done messing around. Hey, can I burn myself on that? Probably. Oh, I can't even do. Let's see, hello there. I was told you got to make maps. He was told, I, I don't even know if this is the right guy. First, you gotta ask what his name is. Yeah, over here. Well, we got a spare. Oh, we got a spare, huh? Spare maps. It's always good to have a spare map. Map of the Ethereum. Just what I've needed. I don't know what that means. I can find my back to the back. It's about time. But maybe I should deal with the thing. The guy, the Hyro. What do you mean, deal with him? You don't know how to deal with him. You don't know where he is. You don't know what to do with him. The Jimmy Johns. What about, the, what about the map? Is this a map? Map, 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 map. Or is that a map? No, those are swords. <laughs> those are swords. Alright. 
uh, well, he said, he said, he said hi Ro or whatever, and he looked into the sun. Uh... Huh, huh. I want, I want to, I want a jump kick thumbnail, maybe. Like this, hey, ha, uh, ha. Uh. Uh, my feet were in the way of the sun, or in the middle of the uh, jump. Falling. Good enough. I'll call that a thumbnail. Maybe. I don't know. I want to burn myself once. Hold on. Leave me alone. Yeah, I'm on fire. And I can roll to put it out. Hey, that's genius. Yeah, roll out. <laughs> Literally, because I was on fire and I rolled out. It's time to finish things, Jimmy Johns. Long John Silver. Only a few members of the ancient civilization failed to escape the dream, and their mistake was so quickly punished to death severely the punishment. Wait, why, why? Their mistake? Their mistake to fail. Oh yeah, you don't you don't want to fail to leave. You wanna you wanna get out. Hop. 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 I like how he alternates beat. Hop. Hop. <laughs> Left foot, <laughs> left foot, right foot, left foot. A skull. Oh, somebody died here. Like a long time ago. Can I grab that? Gimme. No? So we got some creepy music. I just realized this is probably way enough time for this. We should definitely save this for the next episode. Maybe it'll be the last episode. Because we've been going for a while, we've we've done the A and the B stuff, and then we didn't have any choices for a while, and now he's and we we got creepy music, and we're going to talk to Jimmy Johns. I think this might be close to the end, close, maybe not completely close, maybe enough for another episode. So we're gonna save that for the next episode. So let me know what you guys think, and also let me know what you think of the new microphone. You might not notice much of a difference. I I think I think it sounds pretty decent. I, I recorded a episode of Carmageddon, so I've already heard what it sounds like after the fact but let me know what to think let me know what it thinks and let me know what you think let me know what the thinking is and i'll see you guys next time